LBT. Um, did you hear that uh, at WCHQ just put out a new spec? It's M&M's for nappiness screening. And uh, I can just give it to us, it, and it, the, I'll just tell you what the metric's about. It's the percentage of patients aged 2 through 85 who have eaten the recommended number of ounces of M&M candies in a calendar year. And for adolescents, it's 4 ounces. For children ages 2 to 4, it's 8 ounces. And for adults, it's uh, 12 ounces. So um, do you know if we validated this metric at all? Oh, of course I did, Charlene. Validation's my middle name. <laughs> Yeah, so I went through that the process map that we put together and I validated 25 um, patients and I actually did find five issues um, out of the 25. So I think um, what I need to do is put that in the tracker. That's the next step, right? Right. Okay, and then touch base with the data team. Then I'll have to validate another 25. So we still have some work to do on it. Hey, that's awesome. I think one of the great ideas that we also can when we start to work with these clinical sites is um, trying to see what particular color or preferred color that the patients um, like to help kind of drive this quality metric up within their respective markets. What do you guys think? I think that's, that's a good idea. Great, if we find the best color, we can really soar. We'll be yeah. higher than any other market at WCHQ. Yeah. Yes. So first you just need to identify what are the common colors, or I know M&Ms they make special colors, but just kind of get a general sense of what colors that are most likely eaten and just have a starting point from there. Great. That's a great idea. 